Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, we're just away for one night um, stopover down at Faversham in Kent. And we're staying at a pub stopover called the Plough Inn at, at Norton um, near town near us. Um, it's quite a nice little pub, we'll show you around, lovely views. It's about nine miles from here to Faversham, so you could cycle it. Um, or you can go down to the town where the main road from the old A2, um, there's a bus from there you can get into Faversham as well. Um, the petrol garage is just down the road as well, coming in. Um, other than that, it's just a nice little stopover. So I'll, I'll grab the camera and show you the views that we've got at the moment while the sun's still out. Mm -hmm. right, so this is the views from the van. It's just lovely at the moment. Got a bit of sun glaring probably on the camera. This little star. Hello, star. So this is the um, farm yard next to us. I don't know what they're growing here. It looks like black currants from what I can see here. Or it could be gooseberries. Maybe we'll find out in a minute. It's quite busy. There's quite a few pit cars here at the moment. The pub opens about six o'clock tonight where we're going to go in for a meal. So it's got a nice little outside garden area. We're just following along one of the footpaths that follows along from that pub. Um, there's two footpaths. This one you can go up to uh, basically around the little village. Um, there's nothing in the village from what we know. Um, and the other footpath which is opposite to the pub will take you back down to the main A2 road. But there seems to be some walking groups as well around here so we haven't looked at any other routes. Right, so we just come out of the footpath there, there's a footpath sign. Um, you take a left, where we're just back walking down, where the elevator's in front, and this will go all the way down and around back to the pub. So this is a park that's at the end of the road going down to the pub. Um, Norton is the name of the town, and this is the Norton Parish Park. And just behind us there, the road, is the road that goes down to the town. And this is a public footpath along here as well. So we look this up to see where this footpath goes because you can see in the arch down there it goes on further. So wherever this goes in, to another little town or pub somewhere. But it is nine miles to Faversham and it's quite hilly so I wouldn't um, think up we'll walk it. Morning guys. So we just had a quite a good night here at the Plough Inn. Very peaceful. It's, yeah, it's very quiet. It's um, <clears throat> We're not far from the old A2 London Road um, which was we can hear very, very slightly when you're outside, but you definitely can't hear it when you're in a van. Which is one of my worries when coming here, I thought it was going to be quite close to the motorway, but it's quite, it's far enough out to not hear it. Um, so we had a quite a good night. Um, the food in the pub was excellent. I had the meat pie, which is a, a proper meat pie, not the stew in a pot with a bit of pastry on top. It's quite a short crust pastry, which is really lovely. Um, so we had a good night, actually. So we definitely recommend this place and we'll come back again. So today we're going to head down to Faversham. I'll try and do a little bit of vlog showing you where we're going to park because there's um, a couple of supermarkets down there great for parking the vans um, and then it should be market day so if I can get some vlogging I'll do that. Right so we just managed to get a parking spot down here at Tesco's car park. Um, Morrison's is also quite good but it's empty here so we managed to get in here which is quite good to get into Faversham Town Centre. Um, they also have a petrol garage here as well so if you need to top up it's a good place to come.
All right, so hello guys, so that's the end of this vlog um, of the ploughing down at Faversham. Um, we just popped into Faversham, we just showed you around that. Um, and Tesco's, gets a bit of shopping, and we're going to go home now. So please give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you enjoyed it, and we'll update you again another time when we get away, find some new places to stay. In about two weeks, we should be away in Holland, so that'd be quite a nice vlog to do as well. Mm.